Most beds at this 24-7 shelter in Denver are full as more people look for a warm place to sleep. I have individuals that can't afford the housing and we have individuals that lost jobs through the pandemic. And so just a combination of issues have um, increased our numbers. Tracy Brooks is with the Denver Rescue Mission. The pandemic pushed her organization to add 200 beds to meet demand. And after two years, the need isn't going away. We saw 300 more people in February this year that were new to homelessness than we did last year. So our hope is that if people are experiencing homelessness, that they're coming inside because we want to connect them to housing. Across the seven counties in the Denver metro area, the number of people going to shelters went up by 40% in 2021. That's according to a report by the Metro Denver Homeless Initiative. The report also found a 99% jump in newly homeless staying at the shelter. It's about people being unable to afford housing in our region, being in, unable to sustain housing in our region. And so really what we need to be able to do is create a full response or a continuum of, of resources. Jamie Reif is the executive director of the group. It found the affordability of housing plummeted in the metro area compared statewide. Which as we know, as we look at rental prices and the cost of um, real estate, we know this is a huge issue and it just keeps rising. That issue is found at this nearly full shelter as the Denver Rescue Mission works to help hundreds who need a more permanent place to stay. So we can start working on their documents and connecting them to services to help them move beyond this point in time in their lives. The Denver Rescue Mission says it now has case management workers at their shelters. They connect people with employment services and help them find long term housing. The group believes it's working because it has housed more people in the last six months than it has year over year. Alex. Right. Kelly, thank you.